Father is neither an anchor to hold us back, nor a sail to take us there, but a guiding light whose love shows the way. This was found from Love This Pick. Today I'm going to be talking to you guys about my dad, who I've grown up with my entire life. My, I've done more also research on like the impacts that family figures can have in your life, so it's not just, you know, you, I know you're thinking, how does her dad have anything to do with me, or can it have any impact on my life? So one dad, who I think majority of you guys have probably seen on TV, came to mind to help kind of tie you in to how I'm going to show you how my dad does, and that's Danny Tanner. So now how many of you guys know who Danny Tanner is? <laughs> Okay, the majority of you? Alright. So not everyone has a dad or a mother in their life, but I can guarantee you that everyone has a person of impact. So according to Time Magazine, who said it best in an article written about the fatherhood of Danny Tanner, the three father figures, particularly Danny Tanner, occurred a unique role, occupied a unique role, excuse me, in the pop culture universe and left impact. <coughs> my dad has made a strong impact on my life through his hard work, support, and family attitude. My dad has demonstrated hard work his entire life. I conducted an interview with Mike Blackburn, father to my dad, who proceeded to say, I think your father is an outstanding man because he's always putting your needs and the needs of your siblings above his, which is what a father does. My dad, you know, a lot of times, I guess you guys grow up, your mom might be the breadwinner in your house, or you might have a grandma, aunt, an uncle, either way. Someone has impacted your life to where you grew up with that person, like you had him on a pedestal. That was my dad. My dad was a breadwinner in our family. Regardless, I think, of ups and downs that my dad's faced in life, he always put hard work into it regardless of what was going on. Now, based on a survey conducted, 71% of fathers are in the working world since 2012. So not everyone, again, has a father in the working world. Maybe you have a mom, again, an aunt, uncle. But my dad was part of this 71% and now something I was proud of. Now, regardless of his status when it came to working, because my dad's job has changed over time. It's gone from, you know, working at home, traveling, only home on the weekends. When I grew up, my dad was pretty like your normal, I guess, nine to five, home on the weekends, taking a soccer practice kind of dad. Now, as life changed, so did my dad's work atmosphere change. It went to traveling all the time to where he was only home on the weekends. And then after that, I went away to college, go figure, my dad began working at home. And he never really left home. So my dad has always taught me that regardless of the situation that you're in, that if you put hard work into every situation, that you'll get through it. The nine to five, the traveling, only home on the weekends, to now, I would say he probably has it made, just staying at home, working from home. Now, without hard work, my dad would have never been able to do that, because my dad has faced you know, job loss and struggles. Through his hard work my dad put into his life, he allowed, he also provided a strong support to the ones that he loved and pretty much anyone that allowed him to be a support in their life. My dad supported me in two really big ways in my life, and that was in the classroom and also in my athletic career. A big one in the classroom was always, you know, pretty much I feel like what a lot of typical people hear when you're at home, do your homework, study for tests, that kind of stuff. But my dad not only did those things, but he also went beyond that. He came all the way out to fight with me for scholarship day, he made sure that like I always had everything right to get into college because college was never never on my mind. I never wanted to go, I had no interest in it, but without my dad I wouldn't be here today. Not only did he support me in the classroom, but he also supported me on my in my athletic career. According to scholarship stats, roughly four thousand women in the United States play division two volleyball or division two ball, whether it's basketball, swimming, anything like that. 5.9% of women play volleyball. Without my dad, I wouldn't be a part of that 5.9%. Since my dad has been so supportive, it has resulted in a strong family presence and a strong family value. Now, I know what you're thinking. She's talking about her dad like he's the king of the world. 
My dad's not perfect. And four years ago, my parents went through a messy divorce. And based on previous studies, about 40 to 50 percent of married couples in the United States divorce. But my dad chose to fight back through this. And to this day, six months ago, my dad chose that his family values and his family was more important than anything else. And he taught me that nothing will ever be handed to you and that it's important to fight back. My dad's hard work, support, family attitude, and huge impact on my life is what caused me to be where I am today. My father didn't tell me how to live. He lived and let me watch him do it. Say Clarence B. Cowan. Thank you. Good job.